The 2014 Wimbledon men's fourth round saw an encounter between an unproven young talent against one of the old masters, 144th ranked Nick Kyrgios, up against world number one Rafael Nadal in what was the first competitive match between the two. The Australian looked unfazed by the occasion as he matched Nadal shot for shot in the early encounters. Little separated the two as the opening set went to a tiebreak. Kyrgios raced out to a 4-0 lead, and while Nadal was able to mount a brief comeback, it was too much to overcome. Kyrgios served out the tiebreak 7-5 to take the first set and put the pressure on the two-time Wimbledon champion. The 19-year-old's confidence was brimming. A Nadal riposte had to be expected and it duly arrived when he broke Kyrgios for the first and only time. The world number one was back on track, one set all. Little separated them in the third set, neck and neck for the second time. It went to a tiebreak. Oh, that was brilliant from Nadal, finding the passing lane as Kyrgios approached him in. Just dropped in. Second service. Can't accuse Kyrgios of not going for it. The flat backhand down the line he made and had an opportunity with the running forehand. Just overhit it. Now the pressure back on his serve at 4-5.
Dorani, thank you. Thank you. to one up and Kyrgios was on track to become the youngest debutant to advance to the Wimbledon quarterfinals for a decade. Just engaging in conversation with himself after overcooking two forehands on his opening service game in this fourth set. Believe it or not, he's got 31 aces. If you've been watching, you can see why. But if you just joined us, <laughs> we have a new star on our hands in the tennis world. Make that 32. Full of balls, that being one of them that have very much frustrated Nadal that he hasn't been able to execute. Surprising amount of misses on that forehand. Again. Yes. First game. Probably going to challenge that. No. 15 all. It was very close. Probably caught the back of the line. A lot of dirt back there. It's a terrific winner from the guy. Probably wondering why didn't I hit that shot at 30 all the last game? He's had some opportunities that he hasn't capitalized on. And you got to hand it to Kyrgios because he's gotten a doll edgy and he's going for bigger shots. He's not timing the ball quite as well as he'd like, so he's missing forehands like that. The pace of that Kyrgios backhand, that flat one, is, is making it inroads on Nadal. may have had the edge in power but it is Nadal who stayed the course during that particular point Good. one game all four set you remember Rafael Nadal has yet to drop serve. There's only been one break the entire match. And it was Nadal winning the second set. Kyrgios has proven to be exceptionally tough to deal with. Ah! 
Oh, just wide. Love He's opinion. forcing Nadal to play at his pace. He doesn't get the towel off the way he'd like. Forcing the issue, no doubt. Let's see where he was standing conservatively. Six feet behind the baseline. That's what you call power. Light for service. Correction. Now looking to see if there's any pigment on the ball. That was an overroll by the chair umpire. Ball to 15. Curios seems none the worse for wear so far. There's two days off. Good for him. Again, Kyrgios. Kyrgios leads by two games to one for a set, and by two sets to one. Nadal to serve, one two. Fifteen law. Thank you. The doll there played a safer ball. I think that's smarter for him. He doesn't have to, have to hit an outright winner. And you can see Kyrgios was way, way off the court. Don't take any unnecessary chances. If they don't. Slight look of disbelief in Nadal's face that this guy can keep this level up as long as he has already. He was fooled. He couldn't see the serve seven. there. But he sure made up for it the next shot. Just the fact he got in the point allowed him that opportunity. He ripped that forehand. Does he have great reach at 6'4? But he's got beautiful timing. That was the perfect shot there to pull that out wide. Thank you. Terrific angle created once again from that backhand wing. And he 
Bob has great points. This backhand just been rock solid for him. No chance for Nadal. How big Thank is this him. point for Thank Kyrgios? Him. Too short, clearly, but you still don't expect this young guy to execute. Well, actually, we're starting to expect it. Fourth goal for Nadal. 13, 15. Speaking of expectations, Kyrgios was cranking up the pressure. On the world number one. Defensive player we've ever seen. And he's digging as deep as he can right now. Four games to one, four sets, and by two sets to one. And Nick Kyrgios, the 19-year-old wild card from Australia, is leading the world number one and number two seed by two sets to one, and he's a break to the good in this fourth set. Fifteen love. This hasn't been able to let go as often, let loose on balls like this. That must have felt good, but is it too late? Yeah. 
across the line. Three hours of play for his 36th ace. Thank you. Thank you. It seemed to matter. You talked about his ability to move on. He's done an exceptional, exceptional job of that today. It's as if it never happened. It, that's that's quite a good quality. Fifteen love. Well, despite the circumstances which he faces, we know that this man will not give up. Quit, simply not a word that exists in his vocabulary. Still a breakdown. Ball to love. already thinking about that service game. for the Australian teenager. Three sets to one. 
A stunning upset here on centre court. The world number one has been eliminated. You've got to believe that you can win the match from the start, and I definitely thought that. You know, I'm, I'm playing some unbelievable tennis on the grass, and um, you know, he, he he hit some extraordinary shots, and yeah, that's that's what he's going to always always bring. And you know, it was just really good level out there, I thought. The stunning arrival of Nick Kyrgios on the world stage will live long in the memory at Wimbledon.